Hi guys, it's Veronica again. Um, I wanted to share with you that I'm having a giveaway on my Instagram account, and um, I wanna I wanted to make a video about it because there's been an update. So I decided to I added more things to the giveaway because I was gonna do two different giveaways. One for YouTube, one for Instagram, but I decided to postpone the YouTube one, and uh, I just kind of added I added the stuff to the Instagram giveaway. Um, first of all, I want to thank you guys who follow me on Instagram and all, all the people who subscribe to me on YouTube as well. I reached 100 subscribers, and I just want to thank you. I didn't think I was going to get any subscribers that weren't, you know, people that I knew. So, I want to thank you so much for that. And, um, I'm going to be doing a giveaway soon, but right now I just want to get this one out of the way. Um, my, my Instagram is Pretty Paper Things. If you want to check me out and if you want to enter, enter the giveaway, you have to be a follower. And um, all you have to do is post a comment on my on the original post telling me how you got into paper crafting. And I'm going to be getting the names from that original post. So make sure you get the original post. And also, um, I want to tell you a little story about how I got into paper crafting. And then I will show you what is all included in the price. So I started about two years ago um, when I was planning my son's first birthday and I was gonna I did a carnival theme and I just decided that I wanted to make my own invitations and so I just started being on Pinterest and trying to look for the right invitation and I, I decided I want to do a ticket. So this <laughs> this first thing it's like a card. My first invitation is not the best, but it's what got me into paper crafting. So, um, the first stamp that I bought ever was this one, and it's a um, carousel. And I bought the archival uh, black ink from Joann's. I went because I had a coupon for forty percent off from my job, and. And then I went to Michael's, and then I think from Michael's I got, I can't remember which one, but these are the three stamps that I purchased for the invitations, and every time that I went, well, the first time they gave me another 40% off coupon, so I just kept going back. That's how it started, I just kept going back. And, um, um, so this is the invitation that I did. This is just a simple ticket. I don't know, it took me so long because I was trying to find the right punch for the, the sides. And I just ended up hand cutting them. And then I just ended up drawing this with the Sharpie. But I was trying to find the right st um, ticket stamp. And I just, I never found it. And I just did the sides with the decorative scissors. So these are my invitations for my son's party. And I did my first buffet table also there that's what kind of got me started I didn't do any candy until my cousin's birthday which I did frozen candy theme um, well that's why that's the story behind me buying this paper pad from Hobby Lobby I had been seeing it all year but I never picked it up until it was on clearance so once I saw it on clearance I said I'm never gonna see it again so I picked it up it was 450 and it's re this really nice vintage circus. And I figured whenever I get started into a scrapbook or something, I'm going to use this really cute paper for his first birthday. And I started eight months in advance, guys. And I was pregnant. I got pregnant two months after I gave birth to him. So I gave birth to my second son and I had my son's birthday party a month later so I, I did and I did a lot of shopping because once I started with the stamping 
I couldn't stop. I started looking up ways to organize my craft supplies, which weren't, wasn't a lot. It was basically kids' craft stuff, you know, pipe cleaners, felt, fun foam, markers. But I had like three boxes full of stuff, and then I went on Pinterest, and I found the pegboard idea. So then I went to go buy it, and I painted it. And then I went to look for more tools to put in it. And I ended up in Jennifer McGuire's page, and then I wanted all her tools, all the Tim Holtz tools, and then one thing led to another, and so I ended up having a craft room. Sorry about that. I ended up having my craft room, or craft corner, with the two pegboards, a, a table, and some of the recollections cubes on each side, and I ended up having a a whole little section, basically. Um, three weeks before the party, I had my whole craft room, and I did not have my invitations done. <laughs> so, after I got these done, um, I kept basically buying more Recollections cubes. They, right now, they don't even fit, because my, my husband will not let me have the rest of the living room, and he won't let me have the spare room. But anyway, that's my story of how I got into crafting, and I also wanted to show these really cute... Paper Studio stickers that I picked up. I had a haul video. I did a haul video today and I forgot to show these. And these are probably one of my favorite ones that I picked up. The really cute carnival with the gold foil. Really love these. And just I wanted to bring this one up too. This is from my collections from a few weeks ago. But I'm basically going to start collecting circus and carnival stuff so I can do something for my son's uh, pictures and this is another one that I forgot to show in my haul just wanted to show it really quickly so okay so that's my story that's all I want to know guys a quick brief comment on the post saying how you got into paper crafting into this community whatever crafting you do whether it's um, cards or embellishments or flip books or whatever um, that's going to be your entry, and of course you've got to be a follower, and um, if you would like to share it with your friends to give them an, a chance to win, that would be great. And also make sure if, if you're under 18 to get your parents' permission as well. And that's it, that's no more rules. So I'm going to go ahead and show you what is included in the giveaway, and these are all mostly stickers. So the first sticker set that's included is this Hello Kitty foil, I, yeah, foil stickers. And this is a, a big set, as well as this one. So you get two Hello Kitty sets. Then you get these butterflies and these unicorns. And this is... A long sheet. Then you get this gem sticker set in silver and you get the same one in gold. And you get a lot. Then you get the jewel borders as well in gold as well as in silver. So you get two. Then you will receive these laser embossed stickers. These are balloons and these are really pretty. You will get the monster, the sea monsters. What are these? Dinosaurs. These butterflies. These heart ones. Uh, these are the monsters. Um, this one. And you will get this pop-up stickers. These are all hearts. Then you get these puffy owl stickers. Puffy heart stickers. Puffy bow stickers. And then you will also get uh, two sets of stamps. This is like emblem, family emblems. I don't know what you call these, like shields. And you get the lion, the zebra. 
Uh, and this is like a travel set. Stamps. And the last things you will receive are these two packets of sequin and glitter vials. You will get two different colors. Two different color sets. There you go. So that's it. If you want to check out my Instagram, I, I'm, on, I'm on Instagram more than I am on YouTube. So if you want to see my latest hauls, um, go ahead and um, check out my Instagram and follow me at Pretty Paper Things. And that's it, guys. Thanks for watching, and I hope you enter the giveaway. Okay, bye.